Hi, Tom here. Um, um, I've just got back from a holiday. As you've heard in my last video, I said I was going to try to pick up some Skull Candy headphones, and indeed I did. I bought the Skull Candy Icon 2 headphones. Um, they cost me $24.99, and I bought them in the raster design. If you can see that there. Um, so let me tell you a bit about these. You've got the sliders here, which quite the good thing about these is the sh the shape that's there. That you can like pretty much stick your finger in there, and then you can just push it up with your finger instead of having to pull it like that. But if you if you prefer to do it like that, do that. Um, the inside ear cup things. I've got the skull candy. I don't know if you can see that, but it's got Skull Candy logo on there. Yeah, right. Um, on the inside of it, it says Skull Candy imprinted. Probably just about to see that, but it says Skull Candy there. And it says Skull Candy on the top. You get two little, they're like metal symbols of the Skull Candy on each side. And of course you get just like general extra design bits on them. Um, moving on to the wire, it comes out of both ear cups down into your inline mic, which play, pause, and you can also hook this up to your smartphone and you can answer calls and it's got the mic so you can do hands-free talking with these. Um, it's quite a short cable, not too short, but I think it's one of the real short ones. And of course you've got your 3.5mm gold-plated audio input thing. Um, the ear cups, um, when you first initially buy them, if you do buy these specific ones, you, you'll have these ones on the sides. And if you do know anything about the Icon 2 headphones, it, these do detach, so just do that. You just can't really show you that well, but if you just pull them down like that, and then it just comes off, and then you've got the skull cane logo. Okay. And they are, they are, these are like left and right. That little green dot has got like an L on an R in it. So they are specific, so you have to make sure you get them in the right slots. Um, now, the um, sound quality is good sound quality, but if you if you like headphones with bass, I wouldn't get these because these don't really have much bass with them. But the sound is great. Um, my favourite feature, to be honest, is the inline mic because I, I hate having to, if I want a, the next track on, take my iPod out next track with this if you just double click the button it will take you to the next track and if you triple click it will do the previous track um the only downside is it doesn't do volume control so but that's that's fine i don't really mind um and the only the only downside about the headphones themselves this this inner green bit this inner in line bit it's not like stuck in because it's just like They've just like stuck it in with like glue or something, and when you like go to put the headphones on, when you pull them apart, it like slips down. So that's quite annoying. I'm I'm gonna try and put some super glue under there or something, but I don't like that. But you can just push it back in. Uh, but I do think if I don't, I think if I keep doing it, I reckon it will fall out someday. So I'm gonna try and get that sorted out. Um, and of course you'll get your Skull Candy um, stencil thing. So that's all you get with your in the package. And yeah, these are. I, I would recommend these for someone who likes lots of bass. If you're just like sitting, I know taking these in the. Oh yeah, the other good thing about these is. When they're around your neck, they don't annoy you at all. So, because some of the bigger ones, like the Hesh, you can barely move your neck when you've got them on, so that's good. 
but that thing's falling out here. Um, so yeah, I would recommend these for someone who's not. If these are like headphones you'd use like every so often, um, if you prefer listening to really music really intensely, I wouldn't go for these. But that's them. And um, finally, my next review, I'm very excited about because it's um, it's going to be an Apple product. I don't want to tell you which one it is yet because. I haven't actually got it yet, so I don't know when I'm doing it, but I'm very excited about it. Um, hopefully, I'm getting it today, so I might do the unbox. I might do the unboxing today and a review another day. But I'm very ex excited about it, and hopefully, you'll tune into that. Um, don't forget to subscribe, give me a thumbs up wherever that is, and don't forget to comment. Um, yeah, I've been Tom. Thanks for watching. Good night.